Most patients with neuroendocrine tumors eventually have disease progression with available therapies. A new trial assessed the efficacy and safety of oral cabozantinib in this patient population. In this Phase three randomized controlled multicenter trial, 203 patients with advanced progressive previously treated extrapancreatic neuroendocrine tumors and 95 patients with pancreatic neuroendocrine tumors were randomly assigned within each tumor group to receive either daily cabozantinib or placebo. Among those with extrapancreatic neuroendocrine tumors, the primary endpoint of progression-free survival was a median of 8.4 months with cabozantinib and 3.9 months with placebo. And the treatment effect was similar in the pancreatic neuroendocrine tumor cohort. The trial was terminated early after an interim analysis showed superior efficacy with cabozantinib. In the two cohorts, the incidence of confirmed objective tumor response with cabozantinib, a secondary endpoint, was 5% and 19% respectively, as compared with 0% for placebo. Nearly two-thirds of the patients treated with cabozantinib had grade 3 or higher adverse events, most commonly hypertension, fatigue, thromboembolic events, and diarrhea, which is consistent with the drug's known safety profile. The authors conclude that among patients with previously treated advanced progressive extrapancreatic or pancreatic neuroendocrine tumors, cabozantinib improved progression-free survival as compared with placebo. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.